Patty, much of the writing in the Bible are the words of prophets. Now, um, a prophet is someone who proclaims or interprets divine will. And sometimes that does include God's revelation of future events, but not necessarily. Now, there are people who spend a lot of time reading prophecy to try to figure out where we are and what's about to come next. There are theologians and scholars that spend their entire careers on such things. But the question really isn't who is the Christ of the future or of the past, but who is the Christ for you here and now? God gives us these words not for us to wait for something to happen, but to change our lives right now, to help us love those around us, to help us be better servants, uh, alleviating human pain, uh, uh, addressing the human needs, giving that blessed assurance that your sins are forgiven. The good news of great joy is for those around you. There's an old saying that there are some people that are so heavenly minded that they're no earthly good. So, read prophecy. See what God says to you in the prophecy. But don't just put it away and say, well, maybe someday that'll happen. No. Use what God reveals to you to make a difference in the world around you. School, at work, in the marketplace, with those that you meet in your family. God's word, that blessed assurance, that revelation, that good news of great joy, it's for you today. Thanks for listening. Adios.